Hi folks, let's have a look at what Echo Quilting is about. It's a simple straight stitch which will amplify the outside edge of your applique well, or your central design, whatever you choose it to be. So we run a press a foot width around our entire design and then we run our next row of stitching a press a foot width out from that row. And so as it expands we lose some of this of the line detail it just gets softer so all i'm doing is stitching with the edge of the foot against the original row of stitching which was stitched with the edge of the foot my needle is in the center of my foot so it's the same distance to either side of the foot and my foot pressure is slightly lighter than normal um, just so as that I can actually swing around the edges of those curves nicely without the fabric distorting under the foot. Walking foot could be used for this totally fine with that. Now I go bi-directional so it means that I will go um, one direction um, to if I say from the top to the bottom of the bib and then I go back from the bottom to the top and that stops the um, the stitching from it stops it from puckering or getting a twist between the rows of stitches because sometimes that can happen if you just go in one direction all the time it also distorts your fabric slightly so we are going to the top of that seam and when I come into that seam I'm stitching and finishing in the ditch Okay, so here we go around. Looks like my needle's going into that seam, but it's not. Just very simply finish that corner, then just do the other corner. We're just basically filling in the unquilted space. Now we'll go down to the other side start from the bottom so as we don't actually have to have a knot or a join on the seam and as we go around these curves they will get softer stitch length probably a little bit longer than normal i think i've got mine three or three and a half i'm just using an embroidery thread um, just an embroidery rayon um, you could use a quilting cotton or just a normal sewing cotton or a uh, embroidery polyester it does not matter Some quilters, when they do this particular step, will use a monofilament thread or a, a, a something like a monopoly, which is a see-through thread. Um, I like to actually pick a colour because it's actually it is a feature. We're just preventing the batting from shifting around the edge of the design because this will be a high laundry or high wash item, being a baby's bib. There we have it. Very simple, very quick, quite effective.